everyone, this is me Sadia here and I am doing your uh, first week of August reading starting from the 1st through the 7th of August 2019. This is going to be for the sign of Libra. So let's see what's coming up for Libra people for the first week of August. Uh, be mindful of the fact it is a general reading. It may and it may not resonate with everyone out there. So pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. You can always reach out to me for a personal reading on my email ID in the description box. You can also um, follow me on Instagram where do I do upload daily readings. So if you have not followed me yet, you can do that as well. Let's see what's coming up for you people for the first week of August. Um, be mindful of the fact since it's a general reading, the energies could be reversed too for some of you. So pick however it resonates with you in your particular situation. So let's see. Libra. The Death. King of Swords. Temperance. Underneath the deck you do have Ace of Swords, underneath that you do have Nine of Pentacles, underneath that you do have Five of Cups, underneath that you do have the High Priestess. So something is really getting, you know, um, something is changing for you. Something is, um, something around your own self is going to change for you uh, during the first week of for August. It could be a... Uh, tower moment for you which kind of you know uh going to trigger a change in your life or a change within yourself it could be a disappointment be that in your work zone be that in your love zone disappointment coming from a partner disappointment coming from the colleague employee um other employers um it it, it could be anything but that is going to change um the way how you look at things I believe it's I'm picking up two different people's energy here. Um I think that you know uh, it's it's more like you know I'm picking up two people's energy here. Pick however it resonates with you in your situation it could be the like i said the energies could be reversed for some of you i'm picking up energy for a person who is um uh who thought about you know the either you or the person that you are dealing with or maybe the employer uh who who has employed you um you know just pick you know just i don't need to repeat it again and again just pick it how uh, pick uh, how it resonates with you in your situation um I'm picking up the energy that, you know, somebody um, thought about the efforts that they have been putting into it, be that in the work or be that in the love, as I said, um, and they felt like, you know, they have not been getting what they wanted. They have been, you know, putting in the effort, but were not getting the, you know, um, the same energy in return from the other person. If you are working, you were not getting the approval or the, you know, the appreciation that you were, you know, looking for from, you know, coming from your, from your boss or whatever. And that has kind of, you know, changed, um, that's, that has kind of, you know, changed you. You chose to stop getting disappointed with all the, you know, with all the, um, expectations that you had from that particular person you chose not to be disappointed any longer you chose to do your best you chose to do or you chose to keep doing your best so they have no other choice but to acknowledge your work your effort your presence and that's exactly what's going to happen i believe somebody kind of you know um thought about it completely like you know in a, in a very um you know taking into consideration all the um all the areas around it they thought to stop doing the effort to make the other person happy stop looking for appreciation coming from the other person and that's when the one person who i'm talking about took a step back they either you know stopped communicating with that person they either um stopped expecting 
you know, the appreciation coming from them. And they started doing their own thing, ignoring what the outcome would be. They thought that this was the best thing they could do in order to stay, you know, happy, content with whatever they are doing in their life. They thought that they, this is the way that they can protect their energies. If they expect something to happen, they might get disappointed because maybe the other person is not ready to give them what they desire. So they chose to expect from themselves and they would not disappoint themselves. So they have made up their mind that I'm not going to do the things to please others. I'm not going to do um, any effort to get the appreciation. I would rather satisfy my own soul with whatever I'm doing in my life. And once they have chosen to do that, this person here, the King of Swords, that person is going to be, you know, whoever that person they were dealing with is going to change. The change is not going to be very quick. I believe like, you know, since it's like, you know, the, um, the first week is going to start from tomorrow. I'm recording this today on the 31st of uh, July. So you are going to start seeing the energies changed, uh, changing around you, if that's you. Or if that's the person that you are dealing with, their energies around the whole relationship is going to start changing. They are going to see things from a different perspective. The change is not going to get, you know, uh, done within a day or two. It is a long procedure that they, are, they have to go through to understand, to, you know, uh, to acknowledge your effort. To, you know, if it's a love relationship, this person is going to realize your worth once you have taken the step back. So it's, it's like, you know, this person is definitely going to change, but it requires some time. If you are waiting for a person to love you back the way you love them, just take a break. Just pull yourself back a bit. Just let them miss you. Let them value your time. Let them, you know, just maybe you have been kind of, you know, uh, giving them so much that they, they have started taking you for granted. So for this person uh, to value you, you really have to pull back yourself a bit. So they, they could miss you, they could think of you. Right now, if you message them, if you contact them, if you keep on pushing, putting in all the efforts that you want to make things work, it's not gonna be, you know, it's, it's, it's more gonna be kind of, you know, annoying them. So just pull back because they really need to understand that whatever you are giving to them, is not something that they deserve it's something that you really feel or wish to give them it's it's your love for them that you are giving all the love and effort into this relationship into this job it's your passion for this job that you are doing all the effort it's not because of them or it's not about their appreciation so that is going to change them and their attitude towards you it is going to be a slow process you might not experience rapid changes happening with, uh, within this person's attitude and, uh, and you know you are not going to experience the changes very rapidly but the changes are going to start showing up uh, as as uh, as you uh, walk into the second week or maybe third week for some of you you have to be patient with it but that decision of yours of pulling yourself back is going to work for you so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for uh, for you for the uh, first week of august if the reading resonates with you do like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal reading you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you people take care bye bye